Hello and welcome back to what will be tonight's last installment of Dragon's Age. I'm probably going to play for another hour, maybe hour and 20 minutes, and then take a nap before I have to go to work. Uh, we are in the western, I believe they call the western approach, the western reaches. Um, yes, the western approach. We're exploring, seeing what kind of quests we can dig up. Fight something, spiders. Always the cave spiders. Oh, these guys like poison. Yeah, they're immune, immune to poison, that cult. Boxes. Elite mercenary code. Quite the spell he casts there. All right. There's lots of these in the area. Let's go get it. That's what we're here for, right? Occupying the thing. Well, I guess it wants some. Oh, 
Oh, it's got like a bird beak. Man, it's screwing the hole up. I'll fuck Quillback. It's a good name, Quillback. Oh, one of these things. Find ourselves some uh, some shards, so we can go back to Forbidden Oasis. I just can't claim it in combat. Okay, the coolbacks are obviously very, uh, very common around here. Yeah, you blew up. I saw a rift over here. What am I approaching on the map? Oh, the main quest. Shard, shard, shard. The camp. Hmm. making some unpleasant noises. Death root. Don't know what you're used for, but I'm gonna find a use.
to establish a camp real quick. Hopefully we don't run into too much on the way there. Hey. Quit jumping around on loot. Jeez. The hardest time with that. This might be a decent place for a spot of camping. A spot of camping. Inquisitor, have something oh. for you. What do you got? Dispatch for you. What is it? See for yourself, sir. We have here visitors. Thank the Maker. It's been so long since I've spoken to anyone. Have you come to observe the wildlife too? I think I found your supplies. A dead man out in the desert had these on him. Dead? Blessed Andraste. What about Marcus or Jeanette? This is terrible news. I am Frederic of Cero, foremost researcher of draconology in Orlais. I came here with an expedition from the university. But the others are all missing, and our work has been halted. White Claw raiders have made off with much of our supplies. You will help me reclaim the equipment, will you not? You will champion the advancement of science. You're a scholar. What can you tell me about this region? <laughs> the Western Approach is a remarkable place, as you are no doubt aware. Many magnificent creatures make their home here. Vargasts, dragons, phoenixes. They phoenixes. They where few others can. The land was poisoned by the Second Blight. The Warden Fortress has stood since that time. Before the Blight, the ancient Imperium ruled here. Actually, I saw some Tevinters recently. Studying the runes, perhaps. Tell me about yourself. I am a professor at the University of Orlais. I have made it my life's work to write the definitive monograph on the hunting habits of dragons and their closest kin. On this trip alone, I have produced 20 scrolls of notes. More scholarship than has ever been done on the Southern Vargast. But my hope, my great ambition, is to observe the abyssal high dragon taking her prey. A sight no scholar has ever recorded. Mm -hmm -hmm. Are you safe? The rest of your team went missing, and there are raiders all over the area. Should you be here alone? I don't know what happened to the rest of the expedition, but the raiders have left me completely undisturbed. I have also seen Grey Wardens, and strangers in odd black clothing. But they all ignore my presence completely. I have the supplies you were waiting for right here. But... Oh, some of our equipment is still missing. If you happen to find more of it, please let me know. We'll have to speak some other time. So, everyone else who enters this desert dies, but they leave Frederick alone. Odd. Don't get that. No. 
run away. Little speedy thing, you. Probably the supplies that little man was waiting for. What is this thing? Let's, can we kill this thing? Keeps getting weirder. Paragon's luster is good for making stuff. It's like a giant one of those rhino things. Well, no, I guess we're not playing. They want some. Care that one. Knock that quest out. We can rule out Venatori for this. Not enough blood splattered everywhere. Deals with the ventures, why are they? That's your problem. Approve more if they're there, obviously.
Whoa, don't fall in. All right. there. Alright, guys to attack, I think. No, it was my own camp. I guess I could attack him if I wanted to, but that would be kind of a jerk move. Inquisitor. Moving on. And busy. Out of my way. Damn it, Cole. It's your fault. Obnoxious. That doesn't even have the decency to give me loot.
shards in order to get into that place. All sorts of stuff going on here in the in the desert. Some sort of weird castle in the middle of it all. Venatori want to keep us out. Shall we disappoint them? Yes, we shall. Where you go? Yeah, he failed to cut his damn head off. Twice, really, now that I think about it.
do we have here? See what's going on. Well, I'm trying to fight her. You guys got this. I'm going to go loot. Here. Maker. They did something this horrible and wrote about it. These people are wrong in every possible way. Dump all the bodies. Can I pick that from down here? No. There'll be another way up. Nope, that's not it. <laughs> there could be a ladder or something somewhere. on the anti-venom quest. Perhaps it just needs the magical touch. Okay. You guys have your fun. Oh, you want me, don't you, doggy? Yeah, you exploded. I just wanted to loot some stuff. I don't want to fight spiders again. Jeez. Alright, let's go down here. Big area of the game. I didn't realize I was going to have so much to do here. Where's this at?
we just cut you down again. here. the supplies. You guys kill things in the messiest way possible. Back and rest real quick before we move on. Inquisitor. Potions are full. over there. I think that's the one I'm angling for. Really? Okay, 
the Paragon's Luster. Stuff's good for making things. Pretty sure my shield's made out of it. I don't even know what percentage I'm at on this game. I want you guys. somewhere nearby. Huh? Nice down, guys. Bad guys. I found his supplies elsewhere. No good. We'll have to find another way.
Alright, so we can't get in that way. Anywhere without running into all these wolves. Wolves. I don't need to look again. Fall. Fade touch. Oh, that's all the way down. Okay, quest map. Can't go in there yet. She could run faster. Taught you. direction I'm going. Where'd you guys come from? You come here. Oh, I tried to pull him in. Tried to save him from getting exploded, but it didn't work.
are you doing out here? You belong in the caves. Wait before I try and come back. We are running around the corner. Leave me alone. I don't want to fight. Fine. Heaps and heaps and heaps. Of, what's back behind me? Forward. much going on. Come here, puppy.
damn it, I went inside. Get on my way. We'll investigate later. Light overlook. than that guy right now.
Mm. There's a way up there. See the ladder. See it? something. That's more her style anyway. Yep, so you ain't got the right logo everything. this and then it's time I think to go back to sky hold for a little bit yeah there we go quest map so we got the chantry trail supplies let's do that real quick so we at least close that quest out Researcher, what can I do for you? I have the supplies you were waiting for right here. Now that I have my recipes back, I'll be able to concoct a bait the High Dragon cannot resist. I have most of what I need, but I still need to gather quillback intestines and a phoenix's tail feather. You study dragons. <coughs> I'd be interested in hearing more about that. Oh, they are fascinating and little understood creatures, thought extinct for centuries. Now they seem to be making a comeback. The Nevarans wrote extensively on breeding and nesting behavior, but high dragon hunting patterns have never been studied. I would be most interested if you come across any Gurn corpses that might be victims of dragon attacks. We'll have to speak some other time. Okay. Landing patterns. Oh. lot to go on there. They have to get through there first. World map. Let's go back to Sky Hold.
<laughs> Pier. Go back to the war room. And what else did Lady Forsythia say? That she'd rather drown herself than help the Inquisition. Anything else? She said she'd have us flogged alive if we allied with her brother. That does sound like her. Cheer up, Josie. We at least have her attention. You always do find the brighter side of things. We are in the midst of cementing an alliance with Lady Forsythia of Nevara, Your Worship. It's become a somewhat delicate task. Can I do anything to help negotiations? Uh, thank you, but I believe I have matters in hand. I dissuaded her from sending soldiers when she learned we'd struck an accord with a brother she's feuding with. Lady Forsythia simply employs a colorful manner of speech. You're rather good-natured about threats of death and dismemberment. They are chiefly bluster, Inquisitor. Most of them. But I confess I do miss my staff from the Embassy in Antiva. It was always useful to discuss the day's visitors with them. I have time, if you'd like to review things with me. I wouldn't wish to impose. If it were imposing, I wouldn't have offered. Well, I admit, there are a few potential alliances it would be good to discuss. Right on the parlor floor. In front of everyone at the soiree. Who does such a thing in front of their guests? The Duke of Kellington, apparently. And then there's calls lurking. It frightens our guests half to death. Lord Genar still won't respond to our letters. And Sarah. Can she not find a single overshirt with that mustard taint on it? Then there's Dorian. The man refuses to take anything seriously unless it suits its whim. Not to mention... Oh, oh goodness. Have we been here an hour already? Two and a half hours, I think, but no one's counting. Oh, dear. I didn't intend to go on for so long. You must think me quite the gossip. You've been working continually since I met you, Josephine. And that can't stop. I must be going. But I leave feeling less troubled than I have in weeks. Oh. Okay, now I gotta go back down.
I've arranged an accord between the Marquis and the Dowager. Wonder of wonders. Perhaps they can be useful to us after all. All right. All right. Inquisitor. Yep, get that spy out of our ranks. Inquisitor. There we go. Everybody has their job now. Let's met out some justice real quick. Mayor Gregory Dedrick of Crestwood is present for betraying his own constituents. He confesses that, ten years ago, he flooded old Crestwood to kill refugees and villagers touched by the blight. The mayor claims it was to spare the rest of Crestwood, but we only have his word. If the mayor has anything to say in his defense, let him speak. There's no cure for the blight. But I couldn't convince anyone to leave a sick child or husband behind. So you herded the infected into one place and flooded old Crestwood? Were no innocents caught in the waters? Nearly everyone in the village had the blight. I swear it. Have mercy. I couldn't tell the survivors I'd drowned their own families to save them. I, I, I couldn't. Mm. Exile. You lied for ten years about your crime, then fled after confessing your guilt. For avoiding justice, you are exiled from Ferelden. I doubt the Crown will disagree. I knew your coming meant the end, one way or another. I took your head, dude. Would have been within my rights. Take her with me. That sucks. Oh no, she's part of it. I have to take her. That's fine. I was gonna take her anyway.
Alright, I think this is as good a place as any to stop and save. Um, it's 8 o'clock. I need to uh, grab a quick bite to eat and get a nap in before I have to go to work. I will probably be back on tomorrow afternoon for quite a bit of time. Or, you know, at some point for a time. But uh, I appreciate those of you that came by and watched. Uh, keep a lookout for tomorrow. I will be on again. And until then, uh, make sure you like, follow, and subscribe. Polynerdic underscore SY here on Twitch. Polynerdic on YouTube. Polynerdic on Facebook. And at Polynerdic on Twitter. As well as the main blog, polynerdic.wordpress.com. Alright, that's it for me tonight. Um, thanks for watching.